happy Saturday everyone another weekend in quarantine social distancing um, here in the UK we've still not been put on lockdown so we, they, we've kind of we've been asked to social distance and only have one one piece of exercise a day which we are taking now very early in the morning it's supposed to be one of the hottest weekends we've had this year like 20 something degrees this weekend so whether after this weekend there'll be lots of gatherings and maybe um, Boris Johnson will get a little bit stricter and say lockdown you are not allowed out of the house it's just really really strange it's very misty and eerie this morning and yeah, very quiet out yeah it's just really weird it's crazy so we're just going for a very very long walk that's kind of what we've been doing every day to break up our days it's gonna be over 10k i think it is it is because if we done 8k yesterday it's 8K. oh 8k 10, then 10,000 steps but 8k yeah. so Pollyanna's in a push chair no scooter today and Alfie's asleep one this one isn't it look this one it's very pretty should we take that one home no 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 me you know like in Nemo he's not alive Oh, I've got her shell as well. There we go, we're gonna go this way now. We'll go this way. I'm gonna catch you. just got home that was so so 
so long. That was like two and a half hours out, wasn't it? Probably nearly three hours. Nearly three. A nice long walk. Pollyanna played on the beach. We bumped into Adam's mum, who walked with us, but stayed her two metre distance. But it's nice for Pollyanna to be able to see them still, even if it's from a distance. We're home now. The sun is shining. It's so beautiful. So we've opened up the patio doors, the bifold doors. Alfie's in his chair watching Pollyanna play outside. We were hoping to start on the garden this summer, but obviously that's not going to be happening. So, yep, the whole garden is going to be renovated as well. But um, yeah, the shed's going to be gone. We're probably going to have a shed about that big, maybe. So we're probably going to spend a lot of the time trying to clear the shed. So yeah, Pollyanna's just out here playing. Blue's very tired. We've got some toys out, blankets. Just trying to make the most of this nice weather. Alfie's here and he's in his baby Maury um, sleep suit and it's such a beautiful colour. It really makes his eyes pop. It's like a mint. The sun's not really helping, but yeah, it's like a mint. A minty colour. It's really pretty. Here you go, Pollyanna. Some water. What do you say? Hey. Oh, thank you, Mummy. Good girl. Eddie's got his deck chair out from last summer. And we'll play here. Alfie's okay, isn't he? He's happy watching. He gets really amazed watching Pollyanna do things. Oh, thanks, Pollyanna. Thanks, baby. Do you want me to play with you? Uh. Oh, that one must be really heavy. Uh. Wow, you're strong, just like mummy. Oh, good girl. Well done. <laughs> well, no, we've got to teach her to keep it in there. Careful. Good boy. That's how Pollyanna was when she tried avocado for the first time. She was a bit gaggy. Would you like to hold it? Yes? You'll be unsure. He's having broccoli, Pollyanna. <laughs> no, Pollyanna, you can't do that. You'll slip. No, you'll slip, darling. It's not funny, Adam. You'll slip. Pollyanna? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, I know. Did you hurt your head though? Yeah. Yeah. 
Be careful, don't do it again. Pollyanna, she's just such a thrill seeker. She's been trying to do that for so long. Hopefully that will teach her now to be a little bit more careful. Are you okay? Oh, she has got a red head. Oh my God, another weekend, another vlog, another injury. Oh, she literally dove into it like it was a swimming pool though. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Pollyanna. Again. You're gonna do it again? No. No. You'll hurt your head. head. Just give Daddy a big hug. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Blue's just chilling, he's come to join us now. Yeah. What's mummy gonna do today? Hair. Cut your hair. Yeah, I'm gonna cut your fringe, aren't I? Because it's going into your eyes. Now, mummy's not a hairdresser, am I? No, not a hairdresser. And we've only got kitchen scissors and a comb. But we're gonna try our best, aren't we? Because we're stuck in lockdown and her fringe has grown into her eyes. She doesn't let me tie it up now. And she doesn't like clips in the side of her hair. So, we've resorted to this, haven't we? But what are you gonna get after it, Pollyanna? I do it. You hold that, Mummy's just gonna tie your hair up. So I have watched a YouTube video and I have cut my own full fringe once before. Mummy did, Pollyanna, can I use this? Tell everyone, what, what have you just been doing? Have you just been playing out in the garden? Was you playing with water? In the paddling pool? Was you? I think you was, wasn't you? I know you don't like it in your face. But it's not going to be for long, it's all going to be gone soon. How does that look? Oh yeah, it doesn't look too happy. But what's mummy said I'll give you after this? Treat! Sweet, yes. If you're a good girl and stay still, which I'm sure you will be. And then after this, you don't have to tie your hair up anymore, hopefully. Unless it goes really wrong and then it will be tied up all the time. But it won't, will it? It's going to be... Absolutely fine. Okay, now I realise that when I cut it, I'm going to be blocking the camera, but... Right, okay, Pollyanna. That's it. Oh, there we go. Hang on a minute. Oh, it's really beautiful. A little bit. Okay. There we go. Wait, we need to do a little bit more here. There's still a little bit, it's got to come to above your eyebrow, okay? Just think of that sweetie you're going to get. Wow, that looks so pretty. Not yet, not yet, not yet. nearly finished. You're being very good, Pollyanna. You're being such a good girl. Tell everyone who your brother is. What's your brother's name? Hey, what's your brother's name? Is his name Alfie? Oh, look at it, Pollyanna. Is that better? There's this bit here. Mummy's just going to do this bit here. There's a bit, few bits here that I'm going to give you a sweetie. Or would you like a crispy? No. Sweetie? No. Okay. No. Would you like a slump? Look. Hey. Yes, Mummy. These come from your party bag. Uh, uh. These, these were in your party bags. There you go. Because you've been such a good girl. Right, just look up at a minute. So I'm trying to keep it long at the side so that it's not like a dead straight fringe. Yeah, one minute. As soon as mummy's done, 
So I think I've done an okay job. I'm just going to take it up a little bit more. Get up. Yeah, hang on. Right. I need you to look straight. Should we take the rest of your hair down now and see what it looks like? Does that look pretty? You can have another one, one minute. Now, hopefully, Pollyanna, you won't have hair going in your eyes all the time. A very fine fringe, isn't it? I'm looking. Yep, you can have one more. I think I've done an okay job. Just to get it out of her eyes. I've now come up to the top of the house where I'm going to do a half an hour workout with Results with Lucy. It's actually called Results Wellness Lifestyle now. I'm doing the Beach Body program and I'm about five weeks in. This is the first time I've ever committed to any kind of workout for this long. I'm really proud of myself. I've been working out five no six times a week five times a week um the program is only three times a week but i've been doing extra ones and i've really started to notice a difference but i'm not going to show my before and afters or my progress until i can see it a little little bit more just because i'm a little bit like i don't know i've had two kids but my body isn't the best um i've always had a tummy like i've never had a great stomach and i think I finally said, I said to Adam, like, I just want want to say, I just want to feel like on our wedding, um, obviously we're away in Ibiza for the whole week, I just want to feel like at my best, I'm going to be nearly 30 then next year, and I just want to feel like at my best and feel proud, like I've worked hard for it, and I know it's going to be a lot harder after having two cesareans, and obviously not having that muscle there before the cesareans, but I'm trying my best. I don't know how it's gonna go. I don't even know if it's possible for me to get a really toned stomach. Um, I feel like I'm doing lots of work. I can see a little bit of definition, but I can't feel the muscles. So like when I was younger and I used to work out, I'd feel abs like within a week, but now there's like nothing, but there is def the definition. And um, I've noticed a change in my back and my bum and my legs feel so much more muscly. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to put that on time lapse so you can see quickly, maybe, I don't know if I'm going to put it in, um, but yeah, I'm going to do that right now. So my camera ran out, um, of battery mid-workout, but oh my god, I felt like I had no energy to do that, my arms were just aching and... Maybe I should have just had a rest day. So I think I'm definitely going to have a rest day tomorrow. Working out six times this week. So I just have a rest day. Um, but yeah, my arms hurt. I've done one of the hardest ones that I've done so far. And I wanted to do that again. But I definitely needed a bit more. It was a lot of arm work. And I just gave up quite a lot of the time. I tend to not give up on all of the workouts. I'm like pretty good. I complete everything. But today I was a little bit tired, so I did. So normally I come up at this time, just before dinner, half an hour before dinner, um, with Pollyanna, and she goes on her iPad while I. Here she is. She's on her iPad. So that's her half an hour iPad time a day, um, and yeah, she really looks forward to it. And then normally Alfie is up here sometimes with me as well, or if Adam's home, which obviously he is at the moment during quarant uh, during lockdown, um, he. We'll be cooking dinner down there with Alfie, um, who just sits in his high chair. So it works out really well. He does his workouts first thing in the morning, so he gets up, and me and the kids stay in bed just a little bit longer, um, watching TV while he goes down and does his workout. So it works out really, really well. My arms are killing me, so I've got to put this phone down. 